I am on my way to Sabine this month. She is a teacher in our course Expressing and because it is Faculty Friday I will visit her to have a cup of tea and chat. Maybe we can do a little sketch and um, I will ask her a few questions for an interview. So uh, on this uh, bright and crisp cold Dutch day I'll um, drive to her and um, give her a little visit. So I have my cup of tea, happy me, so uh, that's just perfect. And um, well, Sabine has a cup of tea as well, so um, let's uh, start a little bit of an, uh, an interview here. Right at the beginning of everything, when you were little, um, what did you want to be when you would grow up? Do you remember? Uh, well, I remember that I was drawing a lot, of course, but I also remember playing with my sisters. I've got two sisters and we would play uh, at school or we would play hospital or we would play so or we would play that we had a shop. So we were really, yeah, so I could have been a shopkeeper or a school teacher or a nurse. <laughs> but drawing, yeah, um, but as a kid, yeah, I don't think I was knew I was going to be an illustrator, but something creative, yes. Hmm, okay. But, uh, yeah, maybe a little, when I was a little bit older, let's say, when I was 15, 16, I knew I wanted to go to art school, and but when I was really little, school teacher perhaps. And, um, well, you keep sketchbooks, and do you, uh, do you always fill a whole sketchbook before you start a new one, or how does that work? Well, I try to fill one, but I'm a, no, I have lots of sketchbooks. This is a visual diary and you're in it. I don't know <laughs> if I? you remember that we saw each other. Yes, I do. And then I, I made this drawing me. from Koosje. Yeah? The first time we met and talked to each other. So this is a visual journal and I, yeah, it's not very, uh, how do you say, filled yet. Th but that's because I have so many journals. That's the... Um, so you, I, you come back to them? Yeah, yeah, of yeah. Course. So it's yeah, not yeah. like you abandon it. So I think uh, this was, let's say, uh, three weeks ago. Oh, so okay. once a month or something. I have lots of these. I try to fill them before I start a new one. So I started this one. This is specific for, let's say, um, couples who are just married. I have a, and I tried a four in a, four in pencil, and then I started in. This, I drew those, uh, let's say, a few days ago. Well, and then I, <laughs> I have a square one. I don't know if I use it already, but well, I don't think so. But yeah, then I see it. Oh, yeah, I must have a square sketchbook. <laughs> I have this one for, yeah, it's another size. And uh, uh, I also, yeah, that's, it's not that the technique is different. It's just a different shape. And then I have also this small one. It's also not finished yet. There are blank pages and I just go, you know, the... So you just pick whichever you feel like. It's yeah, not like I they are the themed one. or um, or something like that. No, no, it's not that one is for uh, traveling and one is, no. No, it's just um, a mishmash of uh, different sizes and different pa color of paper. What is the... Most recent thing you drew. All right. Well, it's here. Just before you came, hmm. I drew this and posted it on Instagram. It says, oh my God, weekend. Well, almost. So I think uh, it took me a few minutes. It was just a nice post for, uh, for Instagram. And I used an old photo as a reference uh, material. What are your favorite tools to draw with? Oh, well, let me think. Yeah, I know that question. I know the answer, of course. And I will draw it in my yeah. visual diary. 